Hello, hello everybody. As you guys can see, I do have two packages here. One is a doll kit that I said I remember I ordered for myself. This is an op my first open-eyed kit that will be in my collection. I'll be painting painting her for myself. So I think I'm gonna open her second and because I already know what's in there. But I have a package from someone who I wants to remain um, anonymous. I have no idea what it is. She didn't tell me. So I'm just gonna open it up uh, for you guys. Uh, she said she hopes I like it, and if not, that I don't have to keep it. Um, I'm sure what I, whatever it is, I'll like. Cause I, I know who it's from, obviously. And she's a very good person. She just doesn't want people to know it's from her. So this is a gift. I hope um, you guys can hear and see me. I did test runs, so you should be able to. Um, yeah, so, hmm. Let's see. Free print photo tiles. Ooh, interesting. I don't know what this is. Like I said, I have no idea what's in here. Several things. Oh, okay. Um, it looks like something for photos decor type of thing. That'd be great. I think she sent it so I can put them on my wall to liven up my space a little. I think that's the intent. I'm trying to open them. Oh, these are so sweet. Oh my gosh. Look, you guys. She printed out pictures of my um, my collection dolls. And um, they're on photo tiles that I could put up on the wall. That is so thoughtful. Oh my gosh, these are so sweet, you guys. Some of them are dolls that I painted, some are pastels in my collection. So here's uh, this little Miss Skya, Amias. Oh, now I gotta open them all so you guys can see the ones that she printed out. I'm excited to see all of them. These are gonna be so sweet on that wall. I'm trying not to cut myself. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so nice. Oh, look how sweet. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is, wow, she must have just done this, because look, that's little Miss June, who went home today, this morning. So sweet. Oh my gosh. I love this. Oh, little Layla. Oh my gosh. Look, you guys, it's me. <laughs> it's me. And, um, Leo. Oh my gosh. This is gonna be so nice to look at, like, my collection of past and some of the dolls that I've made. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. I've never seen anything like these. These are so cool. Yeah, I love them. I hope she's watching this. I'll tell her to watch it. But these are so cool. Oh, I love this picture. This is one of my favorite pictures that I took when I had my Joanna kit. And then this is my end screen. At, uh, it's not the current one, but it was the one right before the one I have now. Because I added, my current one has um, a Mayas in it, but this is so cool. And then two more. Oh my gosh, she printed out my picture of my poor kitty. Oh, I really love that one. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, poor kitty. His name was Shia. If you guys don't know, he passed on December 28th and um, he was only four years old. So that was kind of like, you know, unexpected, but um, I don't know if any of you're picking up on any of these images cause they're in plastic. Um, but they will be, I'll put some pictures up of them 
on my Instagram, but, and then here's another one of Amias, one of my other favorite pictures that I've taken. So, yes, I, so, I'm, I love them, I love them. I hope you're watching and I love them so much. Um, they're gonna look so sweet on that, on my walls, and I'm really, really happy. Thank you so much, you know you didn't have to do that, you already do so much for me. But, um, yeah, thank you so much. Uh, unexpected. Um, thank you guys. So, yeah, I'll put those up right after I take a break because I just came directly from work. So, after this video, I'll rest some and then I'll put them up and take a picture of them all situated up. I guess this is to make sure they're level. Yeah, that's what that is. It's a leveler. So, yes, I will put these up later and I will take a picture of them all up and put them on my Instagram so that if you can't see them at all in this video, they'll be up on my Instagram. That was such a thoughtful gift, really, really sweet. Especially adding my poor kitty. Oh my gosh, I miss him so much. I'm not gonna cry, it's been a little while. I'm, not, uh, I'm really still sad about it, but you know, this is life. Um, so this is actually, the, yeah, like I said, this is the kit that I ordered. She came all the way from Canada. I need to let the person I bought her from know that um, she arrived safely. So I'm gonna run through some names that I've been thinking about for her. And um, so I have two girls coming into my collection. This one that I'm painting for myself and I'm having a custom doll made by Ashley Thacker, um, the one who made, um, the one who made Layla. She's making me a custom doll, if you didn't know. Um, yeah, she's making me a custom doll. So, I have this one that I'm painting for myself. She's Open Eye Baby, and I'm gonna see if you guys can guess what kit she is. Well, you're gonna know. I'm gonna tell you, but it'll be fun to see if you guess correctly. Um, so I'm gonna start with her limbs. She's a limited edition kit. She's by Laura Tuzier Ross. She, I think she's technically an older kit. Um, I bought her, again, off of someone else, so. Oh, yep, she's exactly the size I thought she would be. Perfect, awesome. So, I don't know if it's focusing at all, but here's a leg, a little separated toe on this. The big toe is separated, and so is the pinky. And, I guess we'll go with an arm. Hope it's all recording. Really nice limbs. I love this vinyl color. It's very neutral. So I don't really, I won't really have to neutralize it. Open hand. Don't know if it's really picking up. If not, I'll do a, a another portion where I zoom in in a second. A little fist. And one more leg, one more leg. Another chunky little leg. It's a really cute kit. It's super chunky and I love, it's like the perfect size kit. She's gonna be like 22 inches, 21 to 22 inches, which is perfect, zero, three months, three months size. Um, so now we got the head. Aha. Oh my gosh, she is cute. Oh, she's cute. Okay. So all I need to buy for her is a body and her, um, her um, eyes. But here's the back of her head and yes, there she is. If you didn't guess, this is Harlow by Laura Tuzio Ross. She's really cute. She has the cutest little expression on her face, her little lips. Oh, she's really cute. I'm happy with the choice of open eye because I was really going back and forth between a couple of open eye kits that I think I would like to have in my collection, whose faces I really liked, um, and she was one of them that I, and um, someone just happened to be selling her at a good price. So there she is. My mom's calling. I'll, pick, I'll call her back in a second. But there she is. And I'll take you closer in a second. But look, inside the box, 
There's quite a couple of diapers, actually. Um, this looks like maybe an honest diaper. Um, some huggy size one. This one is Disney, so it's got Minnie and Mickey. This one is size one, one slash two, I think is what it says. It has little monkeys on it. Um, this also is one and two, more monkey ones. These are really cool. These are extra small, because um, these are all from Canada. So um, these have little sheeps on them. And one more Disney one with just a baby Mickey. Those are so cute. Thank you, thank you to the person who um, sent me all those diapers along with the kit, because you didn't have to, I just wanted the kit, but I am very appreciative and this is very cool to have diapers from a, another country. Um, this is my first time ordering anything from outside of the country. So here is her, um, this is her COA. Um, yeah, Harlow, limited edition of 2000. She is 959 out of 2000. So yeah, it's really cool to have a limited edition, a real like truly limited edition kit um, that I'm gonna paint for the first time. So I'm gonna bring you guys closer She's on the bed, but I'll bring you guys closer so you can see her in detail. All right, so I thought I would show you guys her little COA. This is uh, some of the prototypes version of her. I really like the African American version. I think it's a really cute version of her. And like I said, she is 959 out of 2000. Laura Tuzier Ross, and here's her little face. Get a focus. There we go. Here's her little face. It's got a weird kind of shaped head, but that'll be fine. She's gonna be rooted anyway. I think it doesn't look actually that weird when I look at it now, but it's kind of long at the back, but <laughs> it's okay. Um, and then here's her one of her arms in her hand, her open hand and her fist and then her really chunky thighs and her foot I haven't seen too much of this kit so I'm really excited to have her in my collection I have to choose an eyes, uh, eye color for her I think she's going to either have like gray or some kind of gray blue eye color and I plan to have her as a similar tone to the June that I finished and sold um, has a, a, like a light, lighter skin tone. I think that's my plan for her. So I've been coming up with a couple names for, like I said, both of the girls. So right now on my list of names are Juno, um, pronounced, uh, it's spelled the way that the capital of Alaska is spelled. So not, not J-U-N-O, but the other way, um, Valentina. Isabella, Juliet, Abia, Knox, James, with the Y, like J-A-Y-M-E-S. And then I've been thinking of like, these are two um, strong ones that I've been thinking of for each one. So I think her, she might be Emilia James. And then the, uh, the girl I'm waiting on, depending on how she looks when I'm finished, I think I might name her Micah Juno. So those are some names that I've been going around with, and I thought I would just share you with the um, share those with you guys, you know. But yeah, so that's my new. This is the new baby that will be painted by me, in my collection. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video, and I will see you guys in the next one.